The Boise State football team held its first scrimmage today, giving Coach Peterson and his staff their first real look at the 2012 Broncos. Peterson said last week he couldn't really evaluate talent until he could get his players to actually play football. They did just that this afternoon. A final score wasn't made available since the exhibition was closed to fans and the media. That won't be the case a week from today when BSU will scrimmage in front of the home crowd. Coach Pete was just glad he could shake the rust out before putting on a show for the Blue and Orange faithful. Never turns out like you think it's going to, yeah. but it was uh, back to your first natural, normal scrimmage. Mm -hmm. Defense uh, did very well, created some turnovers on offense. We had a few things going, but we'd shoot ourselves in the foot with penalties, turnover here and there. It really was a typical first scrimmage. I actually thought that the offense would do, would do more, but uh, it's kind of back to those first scrimmages. The offense stole the show through the first week of camp, clicking at a rate unusual for this time of year. But today, the defense got its revenge. Deontay Florence forced a couple of turnovers, and the Broncos' depth at defensive back stood out in the scrimmage. J.C. Percy and Jamar Taylor were happy with their unit's efforts. Yeah, I feel like we all, you know, we all came together and we played pretty good. You know, we had some good plays and then definitely had some areas uh, for, uh, for improvement. I mean, you know, we have our days where offense comes out and they just whoop on us, but we have a great offense, you know. But, we, you know, that's, that's practice for our coaches to get better, and they coach us up and we get better. But I definitely feel like we're taking the steps to be that dominant defense that we need to be. Coach Peterson sounded optimistic about the quarterback situation at his first press conference last week, claiming his staff may name a starter by next week. However, none of the four candidates stood out amongst the crowd this afternoon. I think that there's some separation but it's not enough to okay we got our guy yeah. it's not you know every time we I start to think yeah we're, we're getting might have our guy we don't have our guy we're not where we need to be um, show flashes that we can do some good things but it, you know as we know at this position it's all about consistency Coach Pete will be looking for more consistency from his offense as a whole. The offensive line was one of Boise State's biggest strengths coming into camp. And despite today's performance, lineman Joe Kellogg expects that to remain the case. You know, it, it's still early in fall camp, yeah. and, and we're, we're making improvements, and the defense has given us a lot of blitzes and different looks, and which is good for us because, I mean, that, that's going to help us in the long run. But, you know, we're going to get into the film room tomorrow and uh, make some adjustments and improve from the uh, today.